Ryan Kaufman. Today is Thursday, February 14th. I'm Medina. And I'm Katie. Happy Valentine's Day, Kaufman. And now on to announcements. A reminder to students, today is Lunch Bunch Thursday in the Guidance Office. Attention Interact Club members, there will be a meeting after school Tuesday in the lecture hall, so please mark your calendar. New members are welcome. There will be a Social Studies Club meeting next week Tuesday after school in B154 to further research and continue working on the debate. Physics Club will be meeting Tuesday after school in room A208 for a fan car competition. Bring your completed car to the meeting or bring it ahead of time. French Club members, Wednesday is the annual crepe off, so form your team and show your culinary skills. Join us at the TI Valentine Social today after school in the Global Gourmet Room to make cookies and have fun. Attention 10th and 11th grade students. Are you creative? Are you interested in the arts and meeting people from different cultures? Looking to change the world? then Mosaic may be the place for you. There will be an informational meeting about Mosaic Thursday during second period. If you're interested in learning more about this opportunity, stop by the guidance office to pick up a pass to attend the meeting. The Complete History of America Bridge will be performed Friday and Saturday night in the PAC at 7 p.m. Whether you love history or hate it, you'll enjoy this comedic spinoff. Ping Pong Club will have another meeting today after school. Attention Drama Club members. If you plan to go to state conference, there is a mandatory meeting Wednesday at 7.30 a.m. in the Little Theater. You must attend if you're going to the conference. The Dublin High School Peer Collaboration Program is in the running for a $10,000 grant from NBC4. It's called the Make a Difference Program. In order to win, we need your help. Please consider casting your vote for Kaufman every day from now until March 7th. Kaufman is currently in fourth place behind Hilliard Darby, Marysville, and Westerville. Our vote makes a difference. Please help Kaufman win. It will only take you about 30 seconds to vote, and you can vote from more than one device. So please take out your smartphones and vote from the link on the Kaufman website. And now over to Ryan Prescott with sports. Hey Kaufman, it's Ryan here with sports. Congratulations to the girls' gymnastics team for completing the regular season with a win at the OCC League Championships. They went 10-0, making them the undefeated league champions. Congratulations to freshman Shannon Downey, who won first place in the all-around. Also making an all-OCC league team were Claire Edwards, Nicole Fusco, Anna Pitts, and Megan Way. The competition cheer team is competing for OCC's this Sunday at Jerome. Plan to attend to support the girls at 145. Go Rocks! The boys' basketball team plays their biggest rival, Upper Arlington, tomorrow night. The game is at UA at 715. All Rowdy Rocks should be there wearing camo because it is a camo out. See you there. The girls' basketball team has their first tournament game of the year on Saturday. This game is at home versus Marysville at 7. Everyone come out and support the girls' basketball team. The indoor track team has their first meet of the season at Saturday at OSU Fieldhouse at 10. The wrestling team has sectionals this Saturday, and swimming and diving has districts Saturday. Good luck to all the teams competing this weekend. That's all I've got. Go Rocks. Thanks for watching, Kaufman. If you missed any announcements, you can check them out on the Kaufman webpage.